Hey everybody, and welcome back to Bendy and the Dark Revival. I have been avoiding uh, recording this. And uh, unlike with the first game, it's not because I'm not enjoying it. Um, it's because I'm scaled. <laughs> so let's go ahead and dive right on in. I can't avoid this for too long. So let's just do the damn thing. All right. It is obviously a different day. <laughs> I no longer have my tea. My tea cup is now containing the remnants of hot cocoa that I had the other day. Oh, it's going to start me back. Okay, well, you know what? That's fine, you know? Oh, ooh, ooh, game. Okay. This is completely fine. You know, load me back into the scenario I was in and really make me experience uh, what I have to contend with. And hello, hi, friendo. Why am I going into the very, okay. I'm gonna do this since it's prompting me again. I'm gonna save over my previous save data. Yeah. Um, and we're gonna we're gonna be nice and careful as we crawl out into this area. Hello? Hello? Okay, you went that way, right? So best thing to do for me would be to go this way, right? Am I wrong on that? Okay. Hello? Okay. Still terrible turning. Okay. So. Oh, hey, look. Okay. Hello? Um, okay. Why is that there? I don't like that. Hello? Is anyone home? Okay, it must be locked or something. Right. Right. That makes sense. Are you a hiding hole? Yes, you are. I don't like any of this. No. No, don't make me. Don't make me do this. Hello? Unlock. Locked again? This oh. is getting old. Break the lock. Okay. Um. Now, how the fudge muffins am I supposed to do that? Okay, hello. Management has come up with a new way to reward us employees. Instead of paying out bonuses for or overtime, uh, they've started handing out these little tokens that they can spend in the company vending machines. Uh, besides that, these tokens ain't got value of any kind. Lovely. Obviously, a lot of people didn't like the idea. <laughs> but the best part of the, about the whole thing is that within a week, someone figured out how to make fake tokens that fools the vending machines. Ha ha ha. Uh, we started calling the fake ones slugs. Now, I can't remember the last time I've seen a real token around here. Them slugs are everywhere. Uh, probably costing the studio a ton of money and snacks alone. Hudson Doyle. Okay. So, oh, oh yeah, we, we're going full Bioshock at this point. Oh, okay, so that maybe connects to the other room? Hello? Hello? I know you're out there. Please answer me. Hello? 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 Hi. Oh, I'm so glad you're all right. Uh, Alice. I think you and I have very different definitions of all right. Where are you? In a mason department entrance? 
but it's locked up tight. Good. That means you're heading up. Look for anything you can use to break in. Okay. Maybe there's a gent pipe nearby. Oh. What was that? There's something in here. Audrey, find that gent pipe. Now. Oh god. Oh god, you're short. You're ridiculously short. <laughs> okay, I find you significantly less intimidating now. Okay, we good? Gent pipe. Oh, I wonder where it could be. Hello? Oh. oh. No. Ugh. There's the gent pipe. Yeah. Way Inside a dude. In there. Need to get the lights working first. Okay, thank you. Store power to the atrium supply. Hello? This is not how you do that. Okay, I would appreciate more. Hello? No. If I find you, I'm gonna rip your face off. No, I don't want it. I don't want. Remain crouched to stay low and keep your footsteps from being heard. Watch your enemies carefully so you may pass through safely. If something detects you, find a place to hide or get away fast. I see you coming here over here. Yeah, you stay faced that way. Yeah, you keep looking over there. There's definitely something over there, bud. Definitely something over there. Nothing over here. You just came this way. Why would there be something Let's over here? Fuse. Let's see if I can find one. Find the fuse, motherfucker. Okay, so let me guess. Gotta come back out here to find a fucking fuse this time. Okay. Let me guess. The fuse is on that table you were just working on. Or it's over where you're headed. Wait, no, you're right here. Hello? Take. Oh, it's not. It's some kind of collectible. I mean, I'll take all this shit. Get to get. Over to the place, and we're going real slow. We're going real slow. We're tiptoeing around. We're tiptoeing around. We we're gonna do the thing and hit the objective marker. Going to the thing to get a fuse. I'm now worried about a dude who might follow me, but there's still the spider guy. I don't know why <laughs> I no longer have to worry about him. Okay. Um, hello. Over that, over that way? Okay. Um, oh, hey, look. Back where I was. <laughs> Kitchen's closed. Uh, it wasn't me, sir. You and your octopus face can go elsewhere. Okay. Okay, so the only choice I have here really is to hide and wait for him to pass, right? Because, like, that area doesn't have many places for me to hide from him. 
Looking good, my dude. Honestly, the... The designs, like... I feel like they've worked on the design of even just, like, the regular inky blob creatures. They got a ton more, of, like, stuff hanging off of them. And way more, like, interactions with the light sources. Okay, and then he's gonna come back this way. Hello! Handsome fellow like you. Oh. Don't worry about me. There's definitely no one in here. I'm gonna wait until I know he's headed the opposite way. Hello? But yeah, even the even the most basic of uh, character models in here are significantly more detailed. You just gotta appreciate it, you know. Ah, oh my God, damn it! He's going all the way back where I need to go. Tell me he's gonna do the loop again. Like, that's just his patrolling path. Is the soup ready yet? You tell me. Okay, he's back at the cash register, which is what he did before. He, hit, he hits it again. Hello. Come on down. You're the next contestant on the prices, right? You're not alone down in here. Yeah, I mean there's several people in the area, like Yeah, you stay over there. You do your thing over there. Over there. Yep, yeah, okay. Okay, good. Classic stealth game shit where you have to literally just wait forever. Can I close you? I could close other doors. Why can't I close you? I would like to be able to close you. Because I, I got this guy who's definitely coming back. God fucking... Fully charged, full charge gent pipe required. Okay, let's just hope he does not check behind this door. What's today's special? What is today's special? You kind of sound like the guy who does the voice of uh, Rick from Rick and Morty. Yeah, yeah. Really teach that register who's boss. This isn't happening. This isn't happening. It isn't. Don't even think about it. He said the ink demon was dead, but, but, but I saw him. I did. Yep. Sounds like Wilson's a big fat liar. Okay, got it, got it. We're good, we're Gucci. Uh, father, son, and house of Gucci. Okay. 
Um, I never understood this character. <laughs> Just a weird design for a random character. Ready. Just uh, coming on through. I got a different guy to deal with in this area. Hello? Still? Oh, you're there now. Oh, peak. Oh, okay. Uh, is this enough to hide me? Don't come this way. Oh, no. Okay. Got it. Got it. Perfect. Perfect. We're doing good. Stealthing around. Then we're gonna get a pipe, and then we're gonna take the fight to those motherfuckers. Just gonna pipe it up. We're gonna lay some pipe. Never mind. <laughs> Perfect. Lights are on. Time to get that gent pipe. Hello? Is anyone going to be like, how'd they get into the fuse room? Ah. Shh. Don't worry about me. Keep on moving. Yeah, immediately forget. Enjoy your walk. Nope, 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 nope. Get in. What the f? Okay. That was weird how sensitive he was to that. Atrium supply. Okay, perfect, perfect. Yes. Uh, you know what? We're gonna go ahead and put. Uh, I. Oh, oh. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and listen to this real At the quick. End of every crumbling empire, you gotta hide the treasures. The machine Mr. must me in endure. To catalog and secure some of Joey Drew's more special assets in places no one will ever find them. Sure, that sounds completely legal, right? Anyway, I'll be leaving some clues around so we can find them later. Just remember, this nonsense wasn't my idea. So, here's my first little hint. I finally found a use for those silly motivational posters here in the atrium offices. They're sure to make quite an impact. Oh God, I can't believe I just said that. Okay, so hit the motivational po posters is what I'm hearing. Once I have the ability to do that when I get the pipe. We're playing with fire, no question about it. First gent comes in here and puts thick, heavy pipes over everyone's heads. Must weigh a ton. Then Joey opens up the place for tours to the general public. Are we really thinking this through? For Pete's sake, Sammy's music department is constantly flooded. And while I was giving a tour last week, we almost lost a whole dang wall when a valve blew out. A uh, stupid tour group applauded, thinking it was part of the show. I know Joey is looking to drum up some cash lately, but this is just asking for disaster to strike. One good accident, and there, uh, there's going to be a landslide of trouble. Hudson Doyle. I love that you uh, sign all of your notes there, Hudson Doyle. Oh, 
Just gonna crouch just in case. I don't know what any of these things I'm collecting do. But, uh, you know, what's the harm? Okay, the dark puddles are calling. They, they can leave a message. Ooh, buddy, boy. You've seen better days. Now I can defend myself. Can we? A weapon of many uses. Your all-in-one tool for surviving many dangers. The gent pipe has uh, many useful functions and upgrades once you find the right parts and schematics. Wait, so I can upgrade the pipe. Uh, to use, press to attack enemies and break objects. Okay. What up, bitches? Haha. Haha. It's not my first time fighting with these bullshit mechanics. What up? It's exactly the same. <laughs> it's exactly the same. It's just as slow. <laughs> it's just as slow, and the entire time I need to be sneaking backwards. Hello? Oh, hello. I'm back into a corner, back into a corner, back into a corner. Okay. That's not good. That's not good. Hello? <laughs> Anything for like health pickups? Gent toolkit. Got that shit. Hmm. It looks like there was a thick ink thing here but now no more would that be a hint this is a hiding place oh my god i didn't even realize um okay nothing for health pickups which is unfortunate also i'm realizing now that there is a health bar instead of uh like in the original game where uh, there was just... Oh, what do I do here? In the original game, you'd, re like, regenerate health. Okay. Oh. I was like, we came all this way. There must have been a purpose. Okay. Oh, great. Are we now going to experience what I was talking about, where you're not supposed to go into the ink? Come on. The dark puddles send a gift. What's the gift? Is it something good? More strength. Uh, they didn't, okay, I don't know why I got that, also, I thought I, I would definitely get, like, the, the, the health pickups there, but for some reason I picked up the book, I mean, I guess I'll take the book, is that the gift from the dark puddles? Ew. Sir, you're making a mess. You don't have to kill me. Hello? What? What? What is this? Banish. The powers of the ink are yours to command. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Use powers to send monsters back to the dark puddles. While crouched and undetected, interact with an enemy uh, from behind to banish them. Banishing also restores a portion of your health. Interesting. Okay. 
Hello? So, if I'm avoiding detection, that is uh, a way <laughs> to get rid of enemies without having to uh, attack them. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, it's always useful having a, a benefit to a stealth option. Now I have, you know, some reason to not just rush through here with a pipe. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go ahead. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna stand, because... Okay. Oh, no! No! I can't clock on! Oh! This is the worst possible timeline! Okay! Hello. Get me to the elevator. Uh... Where magic is made, Animation Alley. Ooh. <laughs> Find a way to cross the abyss. Okay. Once again, this is probably going to lead to something jumping out at me. I get the overwhelming feeling that at least one of these times, something's going to jump out at me while I'm doing this. Hello? Open! Open! Crawl through! Wee! Okay. Don't know what I'm doing. But I'm here. We out here. Uh-oh. Don't cry for me. I want to die. Okay. Nope. Not bad. Why is your reach so good? Loot. Yes. Give me your donuts and your slugs. Like, there was no way I could be stealthing through this, right? There's nowhere to hide! Ooh, I am low on health. I need to... I need to get some, some stuff for that. Deposit. Oh? I deposited a battery. Now, why did I do that? Was there a reason? Exchange. Create one gent card. Grants one-time access to safe and sound lo lockers. Ooh, okay. So, uh, places for me to hide, I guess? Um, and then... Oh, I don't have enough. I need one more... Whatever that is. Okay, interesting. Oh, we going we going around. Boy. Son. What we got here? We're in the final days here. I can tell. People are panicking. Uh, <laughs> panicking things into boxes. <laughs> People are packing things into boxes. Tools are going missing. You can smell the panic. There it is. In the air <laughs> around the studio. But us jet boys, we're just watching from the shadows. We lock the doors and keep our research going. Mr. Gray already gave us a little wink. All is well when one ship sinks. Another one leaves the dock. Interesting. We, I just need to keep my ink machine safe in the chaos. Uh, it's the key to so many discoveries. Thomas Connor. Oh, Thomas, you shady bitch. Oh, I thought you were one of the cool ones. One of the good ones. 
but apparently you're just another shady motherfucker. Alrighty. Gonna try to see what's going on around here. I wanted to get to the other side of the abyss. Hello? Studio tour. Here's where the magic is made. I'm Joey Drew, and our story begins quite literally in one of our many writer's rooms, just like this one. Uh-huh. He doesn't love it. I think you don't hear endless laughter. The script finds its way to our many artists in the art department. You'll be seeing our real Joey Drew Studios team hard at work on our tour of Animation Alley very shortly. But right here, you can see a typical office where characters are being lovingly crafted with very careful attention to details. I like to stand over their shoulders as the artists work their magic. Yep, there it is. It's my job to catch the little things that make our cartoons really extra special. Yeah. If I see one of Bendy's gloves is missing his signature two dots, you're, I'm sure I tell someone. You're a micromanager. Like say, That's what you are. Uh huh. I guess this is how I'm ending the episode. I, I I'm just too curious to not do this. Outrageous sound effects. Is that what they say? You'll get a glimpse of my songwriting duo, Sammy Lawrence and Jack Bain, working on a new yeah. tune with our very own studio orchestra. Or maybe you'll spot Miss Alison Pendle, recording the voice of our favorite little lady sent from above, Alice Angel, on the Joey Drew Studios. <laughs> Did they edit the name of Alice? Because I know there was a big drama in the background of the story that Alice Angel was recast. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. It looks like it. Uh, well, he hey, got something there. done. It's Carl, one of our editors. Carl always has lots to do, but he always gets it done on time. I think Carl's and taking a break. Carl, what a trooper. And now it's time to move into Animation Alley and see the Joey Drew Studios family at work. Take Ooh. children by the hand as we enter the nerve center of the <laughs> It is a little strange to be like, yeah, let's go to a trip to the animation studio. It's not really uh, the kind of thing. Oh, 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 battery refill. Was there something I could do here? But I can't anymore because I wasted all my batteries in that other thing. <gasps> Hello? Our friend or foe. Friend or foe, Bendy. 
Hello? Bendy? You're real? Oh, this is amazing. It's okay. It's okay. I won't hurt you. I promise. It's okay. See? Oh. I'm oh. your friend. Oh, as long as he's the... Oh. Ooh. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, oh, no. Know. I promise. He's so sad. I'm so, so sorry. Damn it, Audrey. What's happening? I don't know, Audrey. I don't know. But that is all the time we got for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh oh my god, what a what a what a dramatic ending. Oh. Oh my. Uh but th that's all the time we got. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're liking this, make sure to hit that like button. If you want to see more, hit subscribe and as always, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.